A Senate hearing turns personal for hundreds of Wisconsinites. They want to block a bill that would ban sanctuary cities and fine cities that don't follow the rules. Lauren Winfrey has more from Madison. The Milwaukee-based group Voces de la Frontera packed the Capitol today, busing in people from across the state to oppose a bill they say would not only force them to live in fear, but it also paints the picture that all undocumented citizens are criminals. Testimony after testimony. And I hope that you consider and don't ignore the contributions that we make to this country and what we do as a community. And many moments of passionate pleas. They pray that I don't get pulled over. That is pure fear. A group of Wisconsinites band together at a public hearing to speak against an assembly bill related to sanctuary cities. This is poorly thought out, bad public policy, all done, unfortunately, in service of political gains at the expense of safe communities across Wisconsin. The Republican sponsored bill bans sanctuary cities by blocking ordinances and policies that refuse to enforce federal or state laws relating to undocumented citizens. It would also allow local law enforcement agents to comply with ICE detainer requests, something the group fears would ultimately tear families apart, but lawmakers supporting the bill say the goal of it is to target criminals. If we look the other way, for individuals that are repeat violent criminals, it makes absolutely no sense to continue to allow that repeat violent criminal to continue to do what they are doing. And if the bill does pass and a city or town doesn't comply, the Department of Revenue could withhold hundreds of dollars in state aid. Reporting in Madison, Lauren Winfrey, today's CMJ4. Milwaukee County's compliance of the law was questioned by the Department of Justice in May of 2016. Today, the Justice Department said Milwaukee County is in compliance with the law and is not at risk of losing funding.